to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing my June favorites with you. If you're new to my channel, my favorites videos are super laid back and relaxed. It's just a time for us to come and hang out and share all the products that we've been loving recently. So I'm going to be sharing some things that I was loving during the month of June and then you can comment down below some of the things that you are loving. Today's video is a fun and exciting one because I am collabing with Ashley Santana here on YouTube. I will have a link to her channel listed in the description box down below. She's going to be sharing her June favorites as well. So once you watch this video, be sure to head over to her channel and see what she was loving in the month of June and don't forget to hit that subscribe button while you're there so that you can see all of the awesome videos that she's going to post from here on out. My favorites videos are overall life favorites so there will be products from all different categories not just makeup and beauty I like to share what I was loving overall. Not all of these products were purchased in the month of June some of these things are new to me but a lot of them are things that I already had that I just really found myself reaching for and really enjoying in the month of June. And we're going to have to ignore this hair today because it's raining and nasty out and had to get out and get groceries. And so that was the end of my hair today. For makeup favorites, I did put all of these on my skin today so you can kind of get a feel for what they look like. But first up is this NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer. And this has SPF 30 sunscreen in it, which I love. But this is by far my favorite tinted moisturizer that I've ever tried. I've been using this for probably a year and a half close to two years now and I love it. It's kind of expensive. It is kind of expensive, especially for a tinted moisturizer. You can get this at Sephora, but I do really think it's worth it. I do think that you could probably find a tinted moisturizer out there that you might love just as much as this one, but this is just the one that I've found that I absolutely love. I love to wear this in the summer when I don't want to put a lot of makeup on. On my skin today, I did apply the NARS tinted moisturizer, so you can kind of see how that looks. I didn't set it. I only set under my eyes, so the rest of it is just this product. I love this tinted moisturizer and I love that it has SPF 30 in it. The other foundation product that I've been reaching for this month is this Sephora Wonderful Cushion Foundation. Once again, it's super lightweight. It just kind of gives you like a sheer tinted moisturizer type of coverage. If you love sheer to lightweight coverage foundations or you want something light in the summertime just to even out your skin tone, this is awesome. These are the only two face products that I wore in the month of June. Next up is this IT Cosmetics Illuminator. It's a cream illuminator. I love this stuff. As you can tell, you can see that I've hit pan right in the center there. But that's what I have on my skin today. Like I said, I only set my under eyes, so on the rest of my skin, all I have on are these two products right here. This looks really great with lightweight foundations or tinted moisturizers. You can even wear this with no foundation at all. It just gives a really natural, youthful glow to the skin. I love this stuff. Next on my eyes this month, I've really been reaching for this Tartlet and Bloom palette. I've had this for a while and kind of got away from it. I got into some other palettes that I had. But this month, this is the one that I've been reaching for. It has a great color selection in it. It has some neutrals, then it has some that have more of a warmer tone to them. This is the palette that I used in my pastel pink makeup tutorial, and I do have it on my eyes today as well. I used Charmer to set my eyes, and then I used Flower Child and Smarty Pants in the crease. And then I applied Funny Girl all over the lid, and that's all I have on today is this palette. I think it has a great color selection. It has an awesome mirror in it, and it smells so good. Mmm, it smells like chocolate. Oh, I love this. The final makeup products I have, I shared in my last favorites video as well, but I'm just obsessed with this. This is the Essence Make Me Brow, and it's all that I have on my brows today. I didn't fill them in with anything outside of this. This is a tinted brow gel, so it fills in your brows, but it also kind of locks them in place. I just absolutely love the look that it gives my brows. It makes them look really natural, but it also gives me a little bit of extra fullness to my brow. I honestly love this product. Like, this is a product that I can see myself purchasing again and again and again because I think it's so great. I just love this product. So if you haven't tried it, it's like two or three dollars. It's awesome. Next up for a beauty or skin favorite, I purchased this Bare Minerals Prep Step Broad Spectrum SPF 50 sunscreen. I've been looking for a facial sunscreen that didn't smell like sunscreen, didn't leave that white cast, and it didn't leave my skin oily. And this is all of that. I absolutely love this. I haven't used it anywhere other than my face, but it's perfect for a facial sunscreen. It has high SPF, which I really love and appreciate. It doesn't smell like sunscreen and it doesn't leave a white cast at all. It actually kind of morphs into your skin tone, so it is kind of like a tinted sunscreen, I guess. When you first apply it, it's white, and then it just kind of matches your skin tone so that it doesn't give you that white cast. I was looking for a while for a facial sunscreen, and I'm really happy with this one. Next up, I have a hair favorite, I guess you would say. 
I have these three little guys right here. These are from the brand Root Flage. They actually sent these to me. These are temporary root touch-up powders. They offer them in a ton of different colors. They have like blonde, brown, normal colors, as well as fun colors. We have Cotton Candy, which is a light pink. We have Pink Parade, which is a hot pink, and then Lavender Haze, which is a bright lavender. If you followed me on Instagram, I did a video with these for my Starbucks Unicorn Frappuccino look. So if you haven't seen that, this is what that look looked like. I used Pink Parade, which is the hot pink and lavender haze in my hair that day. That's all that I had in there. They're that pigmented and that great. These are super easy to use. So if you're wanting to try out a fun pastel color like I was, you can apply this all over your head or in certain sections and see what it looks like before you go in with a permanent dye. Or if you have pastel hair already or even like a natural hair color and you just need something to touch up your roots in between visits to the salon, these are awesome. So this is what they look like. They just come in this little bottle here. They're just a colored powder. So you just take it and apply it right to your roots or right to your hair, wherever you want to put it. And then it washes out as soon as you wash your hair. So it's very temporary. It's great for kids. It's great if you just want a look for like a festival or something very temporary. They just come in a little thing like this with the brush on top. And then when you want to use it, you just turn the brush over and the product will come out. My hair is already a mess today. So I'll just go ahead and try this out for you. I'm just going to take a section in the front and then I am going to put the rest of my hair up just so it doesn't get mixed in with that. So I'm going to take a section about like this in the front and I'm not going to do it from the roots I'm just going to do the ends of my hair today I would suggest putting a towel down wherever you're going to do these just in case the powder does get everywhere But honestly it stays in place a lot better than I expected it to so you just take the cap off I'm going to place this towel under mine just because I am in my beauty room and I have a really light colored chair so all you do is start to brush it out And you can already see that color start to like build towards the ends. And then you just continue to apply it until you reach the color that you desire. So it's literally that easy. It's super pigmented. Like it does not mess around. It's not something that's only going to coat like a strand of your hair. No. Look how pigmented that color is. So you can do your whole head or you can just do tiny sections. You just apply them, they're that simple, and then they wash out as soon as you wash your hair. So I had a lot of fun with these. I think they're super fun. I will leave the link to the Root Flash website in the description box down below if you want to check these out. I mean, seriously, look at that color. That's insane. Okay, so to finish up, I just have two products left. The first one is a supplement that we've been taking. This is the Natural Calm Anti-Stress Drink. This is a magnesium supplement, and ours is in the flavor Raspberry Lemon. We just purchased ours on Amazon, so I will leave a link to the exact one that we purchased in the description box down below. If you watch my vlogs, you know that I recently started clenching my teeth while I sleep, so I've been looking for something that can help with that. And my sister actually recommended this to me. Clay and I have both been taking this, and since we started taking this, we have been sleeping so well at night, like sleeping like babies. I don't know if it has actually helped me with clenching my teeth. I feel like it has lightened up a little bit. I don't notice myself doing it as much or as intensely. So I don't know if it is helping with that, but it is definitely helping me sleep at night. And it also helps you. So if you need help in either of those areas. My last favorite of the month is probably my favorite favorite of the month. It's actually a food item. It's a Flamin' Hot Cheetos. This is a new one that they came out with and they are so good. I love the regular Flamin' Hot Cheetos. If you love those, try these out. This is their new flavor. It's Flamin' Hot Chipotle Ranch and they are so good. I'm not even kidding. They are literally one of, if not the best chip that I've ever had. They have such good flavor. You know how regular Flamin' Hot Cheetos are just like hot? They have a little bit of a good flavor to them, but it's more of like that hot flavor. These have such a good flavor to them. They remind me of the Chili Cheese Fritos. That's what this flavor reminds me of. So if you like those, you might really like these. It tastes like that, but then it has the hotness of the Flamin' Hot Cheetos. Mmm. These are so good. I want them like every day. Clay and I have been obsessed with these this month. So those are some of the things that I was loving in the month of June. Be sure to head over to Ashley's channel and see what her June favorites were. And don't forget to comment down below and let me know what you were loving in the month of June. Maybe they're products I haven't heard of. Maybe they're ones I haven't tried out. Maybe they're ones that are going to like 
change my life like these Chipotle Ranch flaming Hot Cheetos will change yours? Comment down below, let me know what you were loving, and remember, you are beautiful, you're a blessing, and I am so thankful for you. Bye. Today I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step -step how I did my own lash lift or lash perm and lash tint at home.